So this is Paisley. She is a wonderful puppy. She is cuddly and happy and just as pleasant as she can be with all dogs, with all people. We have really enjoyed having her. Uh, she, can, she loves to play. She loves to play with her ball, as you can see here. Um, she enjoys being at daycare with the other dogs. She just loves everyone she meets. She has been very, very quick and easy to train. She's doing well on housebreaking. She's um, good in the car. She's great in the crate. Uh, her trainers have just enjoyed having her so much. Here you'll see some of the things that she's already learning how to do. She can sit, she can stand, she will lay down on command. In this segment, uh, BJ, her trainer, and Serena, uh, my 11-year-old daughter, are calling her back and forth. It's just a way that we teach them to come when they're called. We just do a lot of this practice, and you should do a lot more when you're at home with her. We're just using her name, Paisley, and expect her to come to that. Now, every once in a while, maybe she doesn't hear, or maybe she... Um, is just too distracted by the food, um, but sometimes she takes a little while for her to come. They are giving her food as she goes back and forth, and this is the one thing that we will use food for for a long time, is having them come when call and pay them for coming to you. In this segment, BJ's just going to show you that she will follow you when she's off leash. She's learning correct position for where to walk with you. She loves to be with her people, so she's very, very happy to follow in that position. She runs off for a minute, but she'll come right back. It's a very compliant dog. This segment is showing you a work in progress. This is a settle or a dead dog position. When you get them over on their side, you should be able to handle them. She is a little resistant to laying on her side. I'm sure by the time you get her, uh, she will be very good at it, but at this point it takes a little bit of time to get her over there. But then you should be able to touch all her parts and see how if everything looks good. She sort of likes that part of it. In this segment you're going to see Paisley walking on the leash. She's very good at walking on the leash. She enjoys her walks with BJ. She's can be silly and funny sometimes, but generally she walks right beside us and is very willing to do that. I think if you need her to walk on the leash and you continue to work with her, she will be excellent at that. In this segment, uh, BJ's going to show you that she'll do a touch behavior. She just hold her hand out. She comes over to your hand and touches it. Good for moving her around when you don't have a food lure. She also has a couple of cute spin and circle. Try that one again. <laughs> she loves to play when she's there being you trained. Go. You can see that. Tail's going all the time. 
This is another work in progress. This is a wait. It's what we do preliminarily to a stay. So she's going to ask her to wait, step away a little bit, come back to her, pay her for waiting, and do it again. And then in the end of this clip, I think she's going just to release her, which means she can get up. She's doing very well on her crate training. And in this clip, BJ is going to just show you how she'll get into the crate with a little bit of coaxing. Good girl. Can you sit? She needs to sit in the crate and behave, not jump right back out of the crate. Should they always get a treat for going in the crate, too? Should be able to close the crate, walk away. She shouldn't be too worried about that. And then when she comes back, she has to sit down. So here she opened the, tried to open it, and she didn't stay sitting. So she asks her for a sit, and then she can release her. She's a really good girl. Thank you for letting us train her. Here's <laughs> my girl. Okay, you can talk. Hi, I'm BJ. I'm Paisley's trainer. Uh, we gave her a middle name while we have her. Her middle name is not Amy. Uh, you have gotten a wonderful, wonderful snuggly puppy here. I hope she does really well for you like she did for us. We're going to miss her a lot.